Turning our attentions to Crown Hill, Holman Road, Mary Avenue. That's where the roadway is blocked off right now from a collision investigation that continues. We've got Frankie Thompson on the scene. Frankie, what are you seeing at this point at that intersection? A mess is what we're seeing, Adam. This scene here on Seattle's Crown Hill neighborhood is still very active here and not much repair seems to be in sight right now. So what we know so far from Seattle Department of Transportation, a driver hit a street pole near the intersection of Holman Road Northwest and 15th Avenue. SDOT first reported the crash around 3.30 this morning. The car has since been towed away, but the damage left behind is so severe. The pole is ripped out of the ground, leaning on a power line and street lights are hanging just inches away from the cement. Seattle Fire Department and Seattle Police Department are here blocking traffic ahead of the morning commute. We spoke to a man who works nearby and says he saw the whole thing. The worker says he ran to the driver to make sure he was okay. The worker says the driver told him he fell asleep at the, wo at the wheel but wasn't hurt. There's no word when repairs will start and when streets will open up again. We are working to learn some more information from Seattle Department of Transportation about exactly what happened here, what are the next steps. Once we learn that information, again, we will be sure to give you that update. For now, reporting live in Seattle, Frankie Thompson, Fox 13 News.